Leak review! Leak review! Leak review! Hey Bears, I am the Gaming Grizzly and welcome back to Identity 5 and welcome to Leak review! And yes, that's an absolutely original idea. This is absolutely not copied by PewDiePie. This is my very own idea. Never seen before, never done before on YouTube. And today I want to rate the leaks that I found. And we are obviously talking about the Halloween event. Because the Halloween event starts in two days. And I have the feeling that every single day there is a new leak. And today we are rating a few of them. The first leak that I got today is this screenshot right here of the event screen. So how do we actually access this event? Well, we get this specific event screen where we can actually take part in missions, where we can see how many coins there is new in-game currency for this event. As you can see down there, there are some coins and there are also Halloween pumpkin heads. And I think that you can use the Halloween pumpkin heads to purchase new skins or maybe new essences for this event. I am not sure. And we can also see that we actually have to play mission events. And we can log in every day to obtain all the stuff like fragments, clues and so on and so on. And I also found another screenshot. Look at this. This is basically the same screenshot as before, but somehow the atmosphere changed. Just look at it. Beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop, beep, boop. So we have this orange screen right here and we also have this bluish greenish science screen right here with I think it's the it's actually the detective sitting in the window and there's also a little ghost right here. Alright, so this is the first leak that I can share with you guys, the event screen of the Halloween event and it is pretty spooky and since it is the Halloween event, I will rate this an epic 3.5 ghosts out of 5 ghosts. And the next leak that I want to share with you guys, you may have already seen it on this screen right here. Do you see this little, this little icon right there? Well, yes, this is actually the dancer skin that is coming to the Halloween event. And just look at this skin. It looks funny. I think it looks funny. It's not spooky, not spooky at all. And it isn't a hunter skin. I thought that you could only get hunter or survivor skins for survivors or hunters on the Halloween event. But this is not a hunter. There is no vampire de demon hunter at the moment. So what we can see right here is the dancer skin. And she has demonic or bad? Are they bad wings? I don't know. She has... <laughs> she has wings to fly away! Yes. <laughs> and she also has a demonic tail which looks pretty dope. And I like her knee stockings. I mean, they're just Halloween shaped and amazing. And just look at her panties, everybody. She has a freaking smile. Uh, I would say a Halloween pumpkin smile and Halloween pumpkin face on her freaking panties. So this is actually more hilarious than anything else, right? And I will rate this skin for the dancer with an epic... A 3 out of 10 Halloween panties. I mean, I like the wings and I like the tail, but everything else... 3 out of 10 Halloween panties. Yes. And the next thing that we're gonna rate today is... The cypher machine right here, everybody. Yes, we are talking about the Halloween cypher machine. You may... Stop, stop, stop. Don't, don't click this video away. I know you want to click it away because you think this isn't interesting. But you know what? Have you ever seen a skin for a freaking cypher machine? Ah, uh, ah, uh, ah, uh, I doubt it. No, 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 I doubt it. A freaking skin for the cypher machines. How crazy is that? And I really like it. I mean, there's this ghost flying around and the bats and it's just epic. I already talked about this, so I just want to rate it real quick. And this will get... Bum, 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 Four out of five cypher machine ghosts. Four out of five, just because this is so unique. I mean, it's not that epic. It's not something that you can actually have and it's not a skin, but it's a freaking cypher machine skin. 
Congratulations, it will get one point less because it's just a cipher. It's just a cipher machine, guys. Okay, we're gonna give this one point less. It's three out of five cipher machine ghosts, everybody. And the next skin that we have right here is the magician skin for the freaking Hell Ember. And I can make it really quick. This skin doesn't look beautiful. I really don't like it. It is funny, it's unique that he actually got an Aladdin skin. And I really like his weapon. I think his um, the magic lamp weapon is pretty interesting. But all in all, this skin is kinda ugly, isn't it? Let's be honest, it's ugly, right? Ah! Whew. I would just rate this real quick. It will get 2.5 out of 5 magic lamps, everybody. I mean, it's not that... I, re I really don't like it. I don't mind if I'm not getting it. But it is a limited Halloween skin here, yeah? So... It's a limited skin, right? Limited skins. I would rate this actually a 1.5. But it gets one bonus point. It's a 2.5... 2.5 magic lamps. Because it's limited. Alright, so the next skin that we're gonna rate today is the Forwards Gamekeeper skin, everybody. The Forwards Gamekeeper skin is really interesting, looks pretty beautiful, and I like it. I like it in general, it's just a top notch, I really like it, it's just like, it could be a skin even without the Halloween event. It looks pretty dope, and you know what, I would just give this a quick rating right here. It will get... Four out of five Rudolph the Red-Nosed Reindeers oh, yeah! for being epic, for being amazing. I mean, just look at this plushy little friend right here. It's just a mate. Oh my god! And we have another skin for the thief. It's the Scarecrow skin for the thief, everybody. And I'm not sure how to rate this. So I mean, there's a torch. This skin also comes with a torch, which is... This should give... I mean, alone, the torch alone should get 100 points. But this skin... Ah, the thief, guys. The thief... Where's my... Let me... Ah, the thief should get... I don't know. He's my favorite character. I like him a lot. And since this is a limited skin, I think this skin will also get a 4 out of 5 torches. 4 out of 5 torches for a limited skin. I don't know why it's getting so bright all of a sudden. Look at this. It's like white. Everything white. I can clearly see it. A few seconds ago everything was like dark in this room and I had to pull up the freaking... Alright, that's better, isn't it? It is. Alright, and we've just get to the next skin, right? I already rated... Did I rate him? 4 out of... 4 out of 5 torch! Just. Tor chess, everybody. Tor chess. And the last skin that we're gonna rate in today's league review is the Ripper skin for the Magician. It's amazing. This, it's it's bright again. Now it's coming from the other window. All right. So the last skin that we're gonna rate in today's league review is the Ripper skin, everybody. The Ripper skin. What is? What can we say about this skin? It's amazing, it's beautiful, it's fantastic. This skin is probably my favorite skin of all of them. I mean, I still like other characters more and I think other skins are also amazing. But this will get, this will get a 9.5 out of 10 Rippers. Okay, a limited detailed skin that makes the survivor look actually like a freaking hunter. There are so many details and I really love it. I know a lot of you guys think, hey, Chrisley, the magician isn't your favorite hunter. The magician isn't a hunter at all. <laughs> the magician isn't your favorite survivor and this skin isn't that cool. But let's be honest, guys, this skin is so detailed and it's amazing. All the other skins are also not too bad. 
But here we go, that's my final... Okay, okay, you convinced me. You convinced me, just because you didn't stop talking to me. 8.5. This skin gets an 8.5. Scratch the 9.5. 8.5 out of 10. Rippers, everybody. Ripper heads. Ripper heads. 8.5 ripper heads. Alright, so that's the end of the very first league review, everybody. And this is a new way to present you guys the leaks just in a more energetic, funny way, I would say. And rating the leaks as well, giving them freaking Halloween panties as rating. And I really think it was a lot of fun. It was very energetic. It was en energetic? Energetic? I still can't read still can't read and still can talk in English. Um, it was a lot of fun for me and I really would like to know if you enjoyed it. If so, leave me a fat like and of course leave me a comment in the comment section below what you think about the leak review. Leak review. And of course if you haven't already and you want to stay up to date all around Identity 5 and get the latest leaks Make sure to subscribe to the gaming grizzly and also share this video with the whole world. I hope you all have a great day and see you all in the next video. Bye bye.